Hi guys, happy Sunday. Yep, it's Sunday and I am excited to be here. Um, thank you so much for those who have been an encouragement to me in this weight loss journey. And um, I wanted to start off by saying this necklace, my husband bought this for me two years ago for Christmas and I couldn't wear it because my neck was too thick. I still want it to hang just a little bit more, but I am able to wear it comfortably now. Um, I actually thought about adding, getting two more links added so it can hang down more about here, but we'll see how it goes. So we did our family photos and um, celebrated my husband and I's 38 year anniversary on Friday. And um, we did family photos yesterday for his birthday. Today is his birthday. And what else is going on? I think that's got me all caught up for the week. And I just wanted to stop by and say that I just finished cooking all my meats for the week. I did hamburgers um, and I did a uh, hamburger cheeseburger soup. It's called a cheeseburger soup where you just take some ground beef, some beef stock, some um, cream cheese and cheddar cheese and um, you cook that up into a soup. It's really good. If anybody is old enough to remember Hamburger Helper, it's like Hamburger Helper on steroids. It's so much better than Hamburger Helper because it doesn't taste like the chemicals from Hamburger Helper. But it's like that. It's creamy. It's delicious. Um, for those who want to use it, you can add noodles or put it over rice, serve it like that for your family. Um, cause I told my husband he could do that with it because it's just me. That's kind of, I'm gonna call myself ketovore because I still use a lot of spices. And last night I had shrimp and there was some vegetables with it it was sauteed um and it was spicy and they had vegetables and i ate a couple of the onions so i still kind of use i still use not kind of i still use onion powder garlic powder and stuff so i think i'm gonna go more with ketovore so i don't get beat up by the carnivore community not that everybody's like that but in one of the groups i'm in man <laughs> they show no mercy um the other thing that is happening is that um, I was able to fit into uh, these these jeans to take the picture um, uh, for uh, Friday, no, yesterday, Saturday, and I wanted to show you guys. I, um, I'm going to try to do better, get some better before pictures, but as for right now, this is what I'm looking like. Um, I got these jeans at, at, um, Kohl's, they're a size 14, and I did some stuff with the pant legs because they were more of a, um, a ankle length, so I took another pair of pants and added to the bottom to make them where they were longer. I just cut off the legs of another pair of pants, sewed them onto these, and now they're all the way down um, to where they are full length. And, oh, that was the other thing. The other thing that I did was I got a, um, uh, I already had a waist trainer. It's not, it's not forgiving. So I purchased another waist trainer uh, uh, more like a girdle type one with some stretch from Amazon and I love it because when my niece asked me how my weight loss was going I said I'm great I'm losing down and I'm losing up and then I got this tire I feel like I swallowed a bicycle tire around my middle and um, she was like get a waist trainer I'm thinking hmm, I have a waist trainer but I'm not quite ready for that yet um, I still have too much in my middle. I also have a, um, I gotta stop scratching my nose. It's allergy season. Sorry. I also have a, um, workout, uh, waist, 
uh, trainer that I started using. And as I was sleeping last night, um, something came to mind. God pretty much speaks to me when I'm asleep. And what came to mind was I really need to increase my workout time. I work out for half an hour a day. And so in, in addition to doing that half an hour workout every day, I want to walk for 30 minutes. Just walk, nothing special. Just go out in the neighborhood and uh, walk. Uh, I usually walk around the uh, neighborhood. I create my own kind of track where I just go around and I can go around a good three times in half an hour. Um, and so I think I'm going to start that tomorrow morning since it's sunny so much earlier. I can get out, do that, and then come in and do my 30 minute um, workout with weights or, you know, um, the endurance, more endurance type workout. So I, I just want to increase my workout because my nutritionist had even said that people who are successful on uh, after having weight loss surgery usually work out an hour a day. Yeah. When I started, I could only work out for like 10 minutes at a time. And then I worked my way up to 15 to 20 and now 30 minutes. I could really go 45, but I'm lazy. I just don't want to. But if I'm just walking and listening to music, that's I can do another 30 minutes. Um, at one time I did the 75 hard challenge and I think I'm going to do that again, probably maybe um, in May or June. We'll see what happens, but I'm thinking about doing that. And um, it was something else. I knew I should have wrote this down. Something else I wanted to talk about right quick. Well, I can't think of what it is. I guess I'll have to save it for the next video. But yeah, things are going good. If you guys um, want to see anything in particular, I know I'm kind of split. Like I have a lot going on. I really don't show much about my sewing. I'm thinking about making that another channel. I don't want to do how-to tutorials. There's so many on here now. Um, if you have any questions about what I make or anything like that, you could just ask me. Um, but yeah, things are going pretty good. I'm pretty excited about the way things are turning out. And with that, I will talk to you guys later. Have a blessed day.